we are blessed with too many helpers but now that we are doing our work on our own so at times you know taking care of the baby taking care of the family members and doing anything for them or even for myself at times that frustration comes up no matter how hard we try to you know keep ourselves calm but maybe if my kid is bothering me or crying or if he's getting cranky so i end up like doing oh, oh don't do this don't do that so how do i keep myself calm during that situation you i know i have to take care of my family i have to take care, have to take care of my kid but even nahi cha ke bhi wo thoda bahut frustration ya wo panic situation ho jata hai ki ab kya kare kaise hoga aage kya hoga so how to get out of that fear like you know it's no it's a, it's a, it's a valid question and especially in during these times jahan itna kuch uncertain hai aur itni nayi nayi cheeze ho rahi hain and roz hi kuch naya pata chalta hai roz hi kuch naya dekhne ko milta hai and we've never seen this before like none of us have ever been in this situation ever before so it's understandable that there is a lot of anxiety there's a lot of stress there's a lot of uncertainty that leads to this feeling ki kya hoga kaise hoga and of course that comes into as you mentioned momentary lapse of patience exactly exactly kyun ho raha hai aise kya hai wagaira wagaira at least in my personal experience what is health tipika is if you are able to spread and spread may not be the right word but if you are able to spread the anxiety amongst everyone where you recognize that this anxiety is shared and you're not the only one feeling it it really helps and the the truth is humans are horrible at sharing our pain and we feel that we should only be sharing our joys and exactly. if anything great happens to us so hame lagta hai no isko bhi batayenge mummy ko papa ko bhai ko bhai ko ye sab wagaira lekin agar kuch bhi hame andar se kha raha hota hai to hame lagta nahi yaar kisi aur ko kya batana khud hi kar lete hain chala jayega this is something that you know aata rehta hai jata rehta hai so on but i feel and this is just my personal thing that if you have a family if you have someone that you can share your frustration with not to pass it on but to mm-hmm. express it then you will feel a lot calmer because you will then have someone else who is telling you you know what i'm also feeling the same way and the best thing for us to know is that we're not the only ones feeling what we are feeling it suddenly calms us down because a lot of our frustration is ye sirf mujhe hi karna hota hai ye sirf mere sath hi hota hai ye sirf mujhe hi dekhna hai ye to sirf mujhe hi karna hai but when we begin to see that there are other people in some shape and form that are bearing the burden with us we just finally feel included we feel heard we feel catered to and cared for and that really 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 helps if unfortunately there are and there are enough like we are blessed we have a family and they love us and so on but it it's possible that we don't have that like we, we don't even have friends we don't have anyone and all that we have is just our frustration in 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 that becomes a completely different animal and i'm not going to go there because that's a long story but for people like us and you're you wonderfully blessed with 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 a new child and you know, it's it's one year and the best time is coming up but it will be taxing it is demanding especially as a mother mm-hmm. you have to have someone sharing the burden with mm-hmm. you and don't let the responsibility of that burden be shared beyond them it is equally on you where you have to come out and say mujhe aisa lag raha hai and i and i want to hear what you what you feel about mm-hmm. and i'm sure it's fine please don't forget to subscribe to this channel so that whenever we put up a new video you're aware of it